Hey curl friends, I'm Bianca Renee and you're watching Bianca Renee today. And today, boy do I have a treat for you. We're going to be temporarily tattooing our baby hairs. I saw this on TikTok and I was shook. When I first saw this, I was like, this is crazy. <laughs> Who would actually buy this? And I was like, well, probably people that can't do edges, like me. So here I am, I ordered some, and we're gonna try them together for the first time. I haven't even opened them, so this is gonna be a real unboxing. I got them from a company called New Baby, N-E-U, and she has an Etsy store, and I get five tattoos for 20 bucks. And you also get, to, wait, this is more than five. Oh, how many did I get? Hmm, that's what I did. I got the mixed set for $30. These are all the different types you can get. Sheila Marie, Kehlani, I'm so fancy, your edges could never, or swooped. Now, I'm not really a baby hair girl, probably because I just can't do it. I keep trying, I just haven't mastered the skill. I'm not Jasmine Brown, I am not Joyja, I am not Chelly's Curls. They are the queens of baby hairs. I try to practice, I'm just not there yet. So I can't be mad at New Baby. They saw a need and they filled the need for us that struggle with baby hair. So in the mix set, you can customize it to only get the types of styles that you want. So my personalized custom set, I got five of the swooped, three Sheila Marie's, and two I'm So Fancies. The other ones were a little too extreme for me, but we're gonna try this and see how it looks. My first impression is, I feel like I'd be really self-conscious wearing these. Like if anybody figured out that I had on some fake tattoo um, edges, I don't know. I mean, my nails are fake. Might as well have some fake edges. What's the big deal? So what do we wanna try today? I feel like when you wear your hair down, you kind of just go for like the swooped look, right? Nothing too crazy. Okay, let's do this. So I'm going to try to cut off as much of the white as possible. I'm so excited yet so nervous. Maybe I'll start here and it'll look like that. Should we do one at a time? I don't know how to do this. I'm gonna cut this in half and do these two. So I got some little baby hairs right here, but I heard that you should not put it on your real hair. So I gotta place it, let's do, let's do center. Like that. Yeah. Okay, I'm so nervous. I got my little bowl of water. I'm gonna take off the plastic, very important. I haven't done temporary tattoos in forever. I used to think I was so cool. Okay, I'm gonna put it right there. I'm gonna get my towel, dip it, and it says to hold it for about 15 seconds, 10 to 15 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. We're good, ready? Here we go. Oh, snaps. Hmm. Okay, that one's clean. <laughs> this one, I think I'd like it better if I did one at a time. But wow. Let's just do some more. Boom. Oh, that one's cute. <laughs> what do we think? Do we like it or does it look like I have a face tattoo? I don't know how I feel with the hair. It's just like, I don't know. Is it too dark? I think I need to get closer to my hairline, maybe. So that was the practice side, right? I'm gonna try this again on this side and just do one at a time. And maybe I could place them better. So the top piece is the biggest one. Oh, that does look kind of cute. <laughs> this is hilarious. <gasps> that one was a fail. It was too slippery. Let's see if I can fix it. <laughs> I don't know, guys. <laughs> 
Yeah, it does not like hair. I don't know. I don't, I don't think these are the ones for me. So I'm just gonna um, cover that there. You know, as Chelly says, just wait for the wind to blow. And you might see them real quick. I don't know. I feel like I have little bugs on my face. Yeah, maybe if I could start a little bit further back, it'd look more realistic. I just didn't want to get it on my hair. Maybe if it was like... Okay, I'm gonna let it go. Actually, since I'm here, I'm gonna take my makeup off anyways. Let me just see how easy this is to take off. I mean, it's probably quite simple. Oh. I know what, does the website say that these are waterproof? Our edges are fully waterproof and sweatproof. Welp, there's that. It's true, impressive. But since I do wanna take you off, I'm gonna scrub. There we go. So I will come back tomorrow for a new hairstyle and some new baby hairs. It is a new day for some new edges. What do we wanna try today? Sheila Marie or I'm so fancy? Let's do Sheila Marie. It's a little less baby hair because i think the problem is i'm just not used to having edges at all so to go from like no edges to extreme edges it's a little much i just don't want to look crazy i was a little more full glam yesterday i'm a little more natural glam today so if you want to see this fenty ease drop make sure you watch my last video my foundation friday so let's figure this out this would go look for the baby hairs to be on the edges why do I get so nervous? <laughs> Alright, it's no going back now. Brush back all your real hair. All up on the eyebrow though? Okay, got my water. She got that water. I got that water. This is what we're doing straight out of quarantine, huh? Tattooing our faces. I've come a long way. A little peek. Oh, okay. These are a little. These are a little fancier. Um, this part. Let me see if I can get this to lay down. We might be on to something. That looks pretty cool. I do like the one piece swoop more than the little individual swoops. I could blend away the little. Straggler pieces. There we go. <laughs> Look how laid these are. This, this little swirly do, I could never. Okay, let's do the other one. Today is a better day. Today is a better day. Okay, look at that. Your girl has edges suddenly. I wonder if I got like a, a brow pencil and kind of added a couple more like hair-like strokes maybe. I don't know. <laughs> because I'm under so many bright lights in the studio, I feel like you can kind of see like the sheen from the like tattoo film. It might look better in different lighting. I'll insert some photos so you guys can see how it looks in pics. But from a distance, you probably couldn't tell. I'd be a little insecure being up close with somebody because then I feel like you could see like the little parts where it messes up or like the color on my, um, I think that's my makeup. It doesn't like to blend with. But overall, it gets the job done. So in conclusion, I think that I just have to get used to the look of me even having edges. I think that's like the bigger deal is I'm just not used to seeing any hair on my forehead. But that's how you make a smart business plan. You have to fulfill a need. And New Baby was like, some people need baby hairs. 
like myself. So they figured out a way to do that in a very easy way. You don't need to worry about your edge control flaking or lifting throughout the day. You don't need your little edge control brush trying to make things even. You just slap it on and go. So if you are also baby hair deficient, you might want to check out New Baby. It's a black owned brand, small business. Maybe at least try it for fun. I don't know. I enjoyed trying these. If you see me with edges in some future videos, it's probably these because I am not this talented. I do really, really, really hope I can get braids soon or like some faux locks. So maybe when I do that, I could try it again, see how that looks. But that's that. <laughs> I want to know what do you guys think? Is this crazy? Is it genius? Would you try it? Leave all your thoughts below. If you enjoyed this fun video, make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I post new videos every week, trying out new things, being your guinea pig. You also can follow me on Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter at Ms. Bianca Renee. I'll see you guys next time. Make sure to keep those edges laid. Thanks for watching. Bianca Renee today.